As he left, he shot an arrow through a thin slit window in the fortress of my heart. It burst apart and my armoured pride got hurt. But it's no less than I deserved. For wisdom comes from knowing consciously when choice has changed. I loved a prince when a hardened king's what's needed here to tame this lioness. For her claws are sharp and prone to rip a den apart if her desires don't feel met and others' weakness gives her fear. For her own needs full protective. Not from the world that is without, but from her world within. But how could anger read as pain? by the one that she has ripped. For what she meant to do or say is never what she did. She should have made a braver choice, not punished him for his. And so he fled, left her standing on paper legs, alone to fight the dragons breathing fire in her mind. And honestly, it must be said, she nearly didn't make it back this time because she no longer had the gift of youth by her side and her repetitive patterns left her petrified while he rode off into the light laden with the hardships of their dual life. So she continued to fight because of pride, because of dragon's fire, because she had loved him by her side and was not ready quite to say goodbye. And tis perhaps the hardest part of lovers' lives sometimes, to know so well each other's child, yet be unable to help each other's child to rise, to love, yet hurt, to know, yet be unknowing, to have to let go of a love so well known and to relearn that the soul's true home is alone. So does she now wish to return to her majesty? No, no. She wants now to be free for her fortress walls have crumbled and at last this girl is humble.